and the Jackson County Ambulance Service has upgrades they say will help them respond to calls. News 3's Madeline Parker has more on how they'll help the department that's struggling to fill positions. The Jackson County Ambulance Service finally has some much needed additions. Two new ambulances. So we ordered them more than a year ago, but due to the pandemic and the supply chain issues and uh, the shortages at the factory, it took us uh, took us a long time to get them. Ambulance Service Director Kenton Schaefer says the addition to the fleet will help with responses to calls. Makes our response more reliable. The four wheel drive, we have some pretty rural area in Jackson County that we cover. Uh, we needed something that would work uh, in the urban area and in the rural area. So this this works out well for us. What's also special about the patient compartments is the employees helped with the design. Uh, so we were excited to uh, have the, that addition to our fleet. It makes it much easier for our employees that rotate from one station to the next. Uh, the supplies are all in the same cabinet. Uh, they know exactly where everything is, so we don't have to you know, search around and, and uh, get used to different ambulance at a different station. Despite new equipment, this ambulance service, like many across the country, is still dealing with employee shortages. Uh, still <laughs> short staffed. Uh, it's hard to find uh, EMTs and paramedics. We try every day. Uh, we take applications every day. But the hope is the new equipment will draw more potential employees in. We hope that that improves uh, in the very near future. In Carbondale, Madeline Parker, News 3.